Stuart, the results today didn't go the way we were hoping. First half performance, we needed to build a bit of a lead going down the hill and I thought we just didn't control the ball well enough. No, same again, obviously. Play one errors, very costly when we've got a chance to build some pressure. Just letting people off and then penalties in first half, six penalties. We just play four, play five. We've done the tough stuff, they're not getting out of their, their yardage and we just let them off and invite them down our end and just take petulate of our tank and like you say, coming down the hill in the second half throw is going to be a tougher proposition. Uh, we need to change things from, from where we was at 70%. We, towards back end uh, the half we started competing a bit better. We was down to 60% again, you know, 60, 65%. We can't do that against good teams. And To be fair, we're, we're struggling on numbers there today. Uh, lucky to get 17 on the field. Obviously, big raps to Tommy putting his hand up again, uh, playing. Got players carrying Knox, Mike Butt, Aidan Hansen's been too, too tough, Rodri, Rodri Lloyd. Uh, just been saying in the hope. We're looking different shape for next. For next uh, the, the week off will do us good, and we've got players back and some players due back, and hopefully we can go into that game with a bit more stre- uh, strength in numbers and, and where we are. Uh, it is what it is. We didn't intend being in the playoff, but now with results going the way they've gone, fair play to Rochdale. They've dug in and got some results at the end of the year. They've showed some toughness, and uh, we're good to we're good to next week. So not next week, the week after. Obviously, Bradford will play Workington next week, and we'll play the loser in in the playoff game. Just keep to save our lives. We play in a team that will be full of confidence, teams that are performing well all season. It's a bit of a different proposition. Oh, it's that blend, isn't it? They're used to winning and uh, it's like the blending Super League where you've got a team's used to winning in a ch- in championship and the team's not. Uh, hopefully, you'd hope that we're, we're attrition to an higher level of stand- standard and we've got to play the game at our standards and, and, and on, on that. I don't know who we're going to play yet. I'm going to watch, the, watch that game next week and see where we're at, obviously. Plan, plan the week after and it's a grand final it's a massive game it's another one we're saying every week we've had we've had opportunities we had opportunity at Barrow we didn't nail it we had opportunities last week at Featherstone we didn't quite nail it today we probably not, not showed up in that second half and knew it was always going to be tough up the hill and uh, we've got we've We've got another opportunity with the proposal and, and obviously with the formula of how the league's going, we, we get we get an opportunity. So we've got to take this opportunity. We've got to make the most of it. Like we need we need 17 lads fighting for positions with, with a will to play for Swinton and earn a contract either here or elsewhere, whatever happens. Uh, like I said, I want to be in this championship and, and the boys want to be in the championship. So it's all on the next game. OK, Stuart, it's starting to rain. That sums up the day. We'll go again in two weeks' time. Thank you. Yes, yeah. thank you.